Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another episode of the Family Dynamics Legacy Challenge. If you are new here, my name is Chloe and I do various Sims content. Most of them are chaotic, so make sure to subscribe. I have downloaded the Pregnancy Overhaul mod again and then I downloaded the Birth mod again because I want some drama and chaos. And then I downloaded, I think it's called Orientation and Identity mod. We're gonna try everything in this episode but you know i have always used the pregnancy overhaul mod so and when i took it off for a few days i was like my game feels so empty without this mod and now it's an essential for us so i give all of my sims a new hair a new outfit because it's gonna be christmas in the game Tomorrow is going to be winter fest, so we're going to celebrate that with our sims. I said that we're going to go straight to Comic Con. Oh, it's not Comic Con. It's Geek Con in this episode. But then when I saw that we're going to have winter fest, I was like, you know what? We're going to enjoy winter fest and then we're going to care about Geek Con. Although we only have the Geek Con thing left and to reach video gaming level 9. So we are so close. And I'm so excited for that. And these girlies are just doing something together. I don't know what they're laughing about. And this girl is just disgusted about whatever thing Grace was talking about. Okay. And Clementine has been enjoying yoga for some reason. Sonia is going to be in the second trimester in 16 hours, which is really fun. We're going to call our OB and see what method we're gonna give birth in i'm so excited for that so we do have as usual surgery machine natural birth c-section home birth and we can go for pregnancy checkups we did that before so i'm not gonna do this again should we try the natural delivery because it's kind of oh no i want to try the home birth i tried that with fiona and it was really chaotic also i tried that with clementine so it's your turn now to try this mod we're going to choose this option and good luck for you. That's going to be so chaotic. And now we're going to go to the orientation and identity. I actually didn't read and I don't know how this mod works, but I think you can go there and immediately go to ponder gender ID and orientation. I think this is how it works. And then you can let the game choose whatever thing you want. And I'm just going to go to auto assign settings. I just want the game to decide everything. And then we're going to go there and see. She is allo romantic and allo sexual, which is Clementine can experience sexual attraction and Clementine can experience romantic attraction. She is cisgender, female, and sexually and romantically attracted to male sims. So after we see what is her gender identity and orientation we're gonna decide if she's gonna continue with travis or maybe she's just gonna go and date someone else we're gonna use the meet and mingle if she was for example attracted to female sims so we're gonna go for that and this mod is really easy to use i don't know if i'm using this in the right way so if i'm using this in the wrong way please let me know so we're gonna go there and okay let's see she is also allosexual and alloromantic. She's female, cisgender, and sexually attracted to male sims only. Okay. Oh, and she is also romantically attracted to male sims. Okay. And we're going to go to Bailey and check this with her. I really like how the mod is working. So we're going to go there and ponder gender identity and orientation. Let's see what's going to happen. Of course, I'm not going to go and work with all of my Sims love life because that's going to be so hard, but we're going to go there. And why they're all the same? Hold on. I tried to use the mod again. So we're going to go with recalling moments in my life as social experiences. I think maybe she is phased. I don't know what does it mean. Oh, and it specifies more this time. So she is gray romantic, which is Bailey does not typically experience romantic attraction, but might in some circumstances. Oh, so should we just go for the other Sims and try this out again? Well, I was missing with the mod because I really was curious about it. So this is what we got for Sonia. 
So she is allosexual. She is a female. She is out. Publicly came out in her private circle. And then she is a bisexual, biromantic and demiromantic. Okay, this is really exciting. So I'm really excited about that. I really like the mod, but I should have read more about it. But it seems that it's really fun. Also, I have given them a new bathroom because the last one was kind of empty and boring. So this is how the new one looks like. It's not really different, but looks so much better than the previous one. I do like it. So she's going to go and take a shower. We're going to get ready to Winterfest and why the child is alone there. Like why everyone is irresponsible about this child. Why don't you go inside? And later we're going to decorate the whole house and that's going to be really fun. Also, I think we don't have the box to decorate the whole house. So I'm just going to go and grab that. And Clementine is just angry for no reason. So why don't you go and put Ivy to sleep? And for Grace, I want her to do her homework. She has been stuck in as a C student for such a long time, even though I'm playing without recording and I can see her improving. I don't know why. It's okay though. Like it's not a big deal if you were a C student or a B student, but I want to work harder with her. And then for Bailey, she is working as a freelancer painter. She did not join any agency or something. She's just working for her own self. I think this is how you say it. So all she does is painting and then selling it to the public. And then for Sonia, I do want you to go and enter a tournament. We're going to go with a professional one. And let's hope that we do win this time. And I'm planning on saving more money and I want to fix this whole place because it looks really empty. So I started with this bathroom and then we're going to move on to the other places in the house or the other areas of the house. Also, I worked on Clem's and Sonia's, so we don't have much left. And I do want Grace to go and conceal acne because we have to take care of our skin and then the rest are just going to sleep and i don't know if sonia entered the tournament oh she achieved the third place and is nothing to sneeze at oh okay we still need to improve it's fine though so everyone went to sleep are they all excited for winterfest i think so who is not getting really excited at the day before christmas i mean it's so exciting so I think everyone's going to go to sleep. Good night, everyone. They all slept early. This is a miracle. What the heck? Well, good morning, everyone. And they woke up so early because everybody slept so early. We still didn't get the notification for Winterfest. So we're going to wait for that so that we can have a Christmas breakfast. That's going to be really fun. So why we didn't get the notification for Winterfest? Oh, my God. What's happening to my game? I think my game is broken. I can't see Winterfest in my game. What do you mean that there's no Winterfest? What are you talking about? Wow. It's okay. We're just going to enjoy that without having the thing from the game. And this is kind of sad. Like, what's happening to my game? I don't know if I can just remove it and put it back. It's underway and cannot be canceled. And I can't even cook. Oh, we can cook a grand meal. Okay, we're just going to go and have a grand breakfast. And then we're going to go and start decorating the whole house. We're going to put up decorations, which is looking so cute. And oh my God, this is giving me like a Christmas day because it's cloudy and seems that it's really cold, which is really fun. Oh, finally, we got that an hour later. Is it because San Sequoia has a different time zone? I think. Each one of them is going to do a different thing. So for Sonia, she's going to decorate or we can decorate all together. We're going to go red and gold. I do like that. So we're going to do that with Grace and Bailey. Look at them decorating the Christmas tree. Oh my God. We're going to continue with the ornaments. Also, we want red and gold. We're going to do that with everyone. Let's have that Clementine finished cooking. And then I have to put the pile of gifts because we want a lot of gifts this time. Oh my God, this is so cute. They're having so much fun except Sonia because she's pregnant and she's going through a lot. So it's okay, honey. And there is 
the Christmas breakfast. Oh my God, that looks so good. And Clementine is just going to go and call everyone to meal. And we lost the Christmas thing again. I don't know what's happening to my game. But there is everyone going to sit there. I think we don't have enough space for everyone. But it's okay. And then later we do have to invite Travis over. But Sonia babe. What's happening to you? I think Sonia's hormones are just all over the place. But we're going to go and add presents. Everyone's just going to go and add presents. And let's hope that we get good presents this year. And let's just go and add presents oh my god this is so sad i have just realized that i forgot my brother's name oh cyrus is not here oh my god we're gonna invite travis over i'm kind of sad about cyrus clementine's just going through something i don't know what's happening to her oh but she looks so hot clementine i do like this so much and maybe we should all play video games together that's gonna be so fun we're gonna go with a multiplayer party frenzy. We're gonna play with Grace, Bailey, and Clementine. At some point, I think that Clementine used to like programming and video gaming. It's when I first started or about to start this generation when I didn't know which one was the heir. But looks like she's not interested in any of that anymore. Look at her. She just left and went to her yoga mat. I do think and believe that she hates video gaming. She's not into that. And can you invite Travis over? I don't know why he can't just come straight inside. Why should we just go and invite you in? You just have to come inside, babe. Just come inside. We're going to wait for Sony or are going to wait for too long because she's playing video games. And, you know, people who play video games, they're not going to care about anything. And as you can see, guys, I can't see the Winter Fist thing anymore. So that must be a glitch or something because the latest updates were so bad and clementine can you please just let him know that he should just come inside are you stuck travis are you okay she's gonna tell him a joke she's definitely gonna be like oh do you still feel shy when you are around us that shouldn't be a thing anymore because you're just one of us and oh my god look at the pile of gifts that's so fun grace is just in her own bubble i think in her own world i would say and i think at some point we were talking to amy i don't see her oh she's there okay why don't you invite her over maybe you should just talk together and then maybe she wants just to go back to her house and celebrate with her family they did not even finish decorating the whole christmas tree what's happening to them that should be like the best thing to do during christmas time i think that clementine was fighting with Travis, which is so funny. Okay, I don't get them. And then we're just gonna add the last thing, which is the tree skirt. Also, we're gonna go with red and gold. We're gonna do this all together. It's so sad that toddlers can't do anything. And look at them, they're all busy working on the tree. Oh, hey, Amy. She's like, happy winter fest every. Oh my God, Travis, you're half naked and walking there. Are you okay? And he is also contributing to decorating the tree. Bessie, what's going on? I know that you want to impress Sonia, but not like that. Oh my God. I forgot to invite Saffron over. I always forget about her. Oh my God, this is so sad. Oh, I totally forgot to invite Saffron. So we're just going to go and do that. Also, this girl needs a bath. So why don't you go and give your cousin a bath? Because she deserves a good bath before christmas celebration so we're gonna go and do that and then clementine's just gonna go again and prepare the dinner why don't we just go for ham dinner and then we're gonna celebrate christmas together and guys i'm thinking about something so ivy's birthday is gonna be tomorrow and it doesn't matter if we did her birthday today i'm so excited to see her so I know it's kind of cheating to age up your son before their birthday, but we're only a few hours away from aging her up. So I'm just going to go and do that. Oh my God, Saffron. Do you guys like her new hair? I give her a new hair color because I think it's really fun to change your hair color. And I think it suits her a lot. And we all know that Saffron likes to do so many changes. And I thought this is like suitable for her. 
and we're just gonna go and bake maybe a strawberry cake it doesn't have to be a winter cake so we're just gonna go and do that i don't know i think the whole seasons pack is not working because as you can see i was trying to decorate the tree and i don't know what's happening so yeah the panel like you can't see anything so i would assume it's because of the new update it's fine we got used to that so we're just waiting for the cake and why don't you just immediately put the candles because we all know that sims just get crazy whenever they see a cake simply and while we're waiting for the dinner we're just gonna go and play video games and i don't know why travis left he just came to my house to be half naked and leave he's so weird but it's fine we like weird sims we're living for weird sims right we're just gonna go and eat and later we're gonna age up ivy and then the last thing is opening the presents so our big sister is gonna call us to meal she's trying to keep the tradition of eating together just like how sonia i mean just how fiona was doing that and everyone's there except our baby we're waiting for her to come downstairs like what the actual heck i thought they were all gonna sit together and eat and how oh my god i thought that the food was spoiled and i was like didn't we just did that travis are you okay at first you came half naked now you're angry i don't know who he is fighting with with your daughter are you fighting with your daughter what's happening to him you know ivy you can just go and ask for a present oh my god let's wish for a toy or something so we're just gonna go and do that oh my god father winter don't be shy just come inside and give me a lot of gifts and grace just stop talking to a stranger and come over there and ask for a present we're gonna go for a respectful introduction did you get the gift ask for a present you know it's always painful to ask santa for a gift can you just ask him for a gift you know what i don't care about that we're just gonna go and open present all together i don't know what's happening to seasons it's very broken but there we are all of us opening some presents together and all of my sims seems to be bored af so you know what seems that you really need the gift you really want this gift so why don't you go and try to ask for your gift i tried to do that so it's not working it's fine though they're all busy opening their gifts which is so fun and clementine clementine who sleeps at this time on winterfest day did you even open your gifts she did and guys i think i'm gonna sell all the gifts because we need to renovate the whole house and i'm just gonna form a group we're gonna gather and age up ivy why saffron left i wanted her to be there so clementine is gonna take the honor of aging up ivy so we're gonna go and do that are you going to age her up oh and it says it's almost ivy's birthday and now we can't officially age her up i asked them to age her up oh my god they are all sleeping what are you talking about what the heck is that please everyone wake up holy guacamole it's only travis and clementine who are excited no freaking way you are all going to wake up and celebrate ivy's birthday i really don't care about anything and also they decided all of a sudden to forget about the damn group that i have formed sonia babe i hope that she doesn't give birth now because that's gonna be hella chaotic no i want that to be for the next episode i just want to dedicate a whole episode for my sims birth and now we're gonna age up ivy oh my god the next heir oh happy birthday and she aged up oh my god so for the next generation we're gonna read the next generation's rules once we started although we have to be cheerful unflirty and loves the outdoor and we are gonna be a curator or a collector our aspiration is gonna be a collector i don't know what is that so we can be just a multi-skill and maybe i think mind and body suits this whole thing and we can either be cheerful or loves the outdoor 
I'm gonna go with cheerful and this is our baby oh my god this is so exciting now we're gonna move to Cass and give her a makeover and I think this is gonna be the end of today's gameplay it's so laggy and and bad but we're just gonna go and give her a makeover I'm so excited for that okay so this is Ivy I'm gonna give her a quick makeover and come back well, this is the makeover that I give to Ivy. I know that she looks so different at the beginning of the cast video. I don't know how to say that. But I give her a different eyebrow, a different skin overlay. She had a skin overlay, but it was, I think, broken. So I have to take it out. Or I think she had a broken skin. That's why she was looking kind of scary. And this is how she looks like. I don't know who does she look like. I think she is a mix between Sonia and Travis, but I don't know who does she look like, but her lips are exactly, you're gonna see that. Ivy's lips are just like Clem's and Saffron, and I think Cyrus had the same lip shape, and that was Benjamin's lip shape, and she got it, but let me be honest, I just gave her a bigger lip, like I changed it slightly not a lot but you can still see that she has the same lip and Sonia has Fiona's lips but the other features I think her nose is mostly like Sonia and Fiona oh my god what's happening to me I'm like my grandma when she looks at me and she's like oh my god your eyebrows are like whoever and your eyes and you know the grandma stuff so yeah this is gonna be it for today's episode it's really buggy and i'm really sorry for that you know we can't control that as a creators and we want to do the best we could but sometimes the game is just very very buggy and laggy and it's fine but overall, that was a very chaotic episode. Like, it's very random. We celebrated Winterfest, which is just like the real life. I know that Christmas is almost next week, but there we are. Hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. In the next episode, we're definitely going to have baby number two. So please, if you do have any name suggestions, please leave them down below. And I think that Ivy is definitely going to be the next heir. So just feel free to suggest any name and I'm just going to pick one of them. So thank you so much for watching this episode and I'm going to see you in another one. Bye.